Uh, DJ Expo 2018, this is the walk around video here, kind of showing you a little bit about what's going on here at DJ Expo in the exhibit hall uh, with the different vendors and such. It is the morning before, so you're getting a sneak peek here if you're watching this live. You're going to see it uh, a couple of hours before the doors open, so we're still having some folks set up and such as we go through. So. Uh, we mentioned yesterday, of course, RCF is here. They've got a sound booth that they're going to be doing upstairs. We're looking at the J8 right there, the Evox J8, which is a little bit of a compact system. A poly cabinet, lightweight, trans easily move, move and such. I've been doing some things with that. Uh, let's go. We'll go down one side and I'll come back down the other side. You guys are getting set up here. Good morning, guys. Oh, nice LED. LED screen's getting uh, ready to roll here. Top Hits USA. Well, yeah, it should Right be. there. And of course, Gator is gonna, going to be unboxing a ton of gear here this morning and have things ready to roll. National Association of Mobile Entertainers is set up. They were ready to roll yesterday with their ProMobileDJ.com website, which has a lot of information and such. You can go check that out. Jetpack, they'll be here with their backpacks. I think they have six different backpacks. And Shaney, of course, is a proud owner. There's the backpacks I'm showing the cam, two different cameras here. And they're in, in the box right there. You can see a little bit. Ton has got some, Tom, Ton and Will are here and they will be showing us a lot of stuff. Uh, Colorado Sound and Light with their, they were one of the first companies that did the all-in-one solution like that. Put it in a box, put your floods and everything in there. So your light show was basically one handle, maybe clamped together, but they were one of the very first ones to do that. And then of course they have their uplighting. And more uplighting over there. Jim creates a lot of really cool stuff. DJ Expo store, where they've got t-shirts and such. I think I've got a 15 year old who'll probably want to come and talk to them. Rock and roller carts here. Uh, rock and roller and the next couple of booths are going to be repped by, by Canal Sound and Lights, one of the manufacturers, or excuse me, one of the dealers here, with the pig hog wires. And there is the Stealth. That's the one that we were kind of talking about last night that was new to the show. The Stealth cart from Rock and Roller with the black wheels and the kind of a cool fork in front. And then they put, let's see, bigger wheels on one of the smaller ones. I don't remember if it was the, the R6, I believe. They put some larger wheels on the R6 so that you can take that over rough terrain. I use the R6 when we travel. That goes with uh, whenever we're driving somewhere. That holds, takes our luggage. And of course, I've got the big boy for my DJ show. Hello, hey, all the way from India this morning. Good morning, well, maybe good evening for you. Good morning for us. Uh, and then I just ordered actually the R18 because I that those wide tires. It's just I, I do so many events where I'm going over rough terrain. I need that I need that that uh, wire tire. So we're over here to the LD Systems booth. We've got the Maui speakers, which are the array speakers in 28 and 11, down to the five, which is over here. Where am I? At? Oh, I got two cameras, so that's gonna be a little more difficult. There's the five over on that side, and then they have the curve which is giving you kind of that more of a, as Ben still refers to it as a concert array where you're having the sound go out at different angles. I gotta tip, I gotta tip these two, two uh, cameras so that I'm getting a, the same. So when I'm talking into one, oh yeah, okay boy, that's not gonna work too well either. So we're gonna do more from live stream. So that's the array. Um, from LD Systems, and then they have their gravity. Gosh, I, you know, I, I should have paid attention to it. But they basically have the, this light stand and a light tree configuration that you can see over here. I think it was a gravity stand. And they have a little topper on that. Yes, gravity. Gravity G rings, that must be the top. I'm not exactly sure, but anyway, they, so it has a cool base plate. Really be kind of neat as I was looking at it because you, you won't have the legs of a tripod like that. So definitely something you want to check out if that's of interest. And hey, a white bike stand. Nice. ADJ booth is next. And again, they, they are 
going to be uh, repped here by Canal. So if you see something, if you're looking for some ADJ pricing, just give them a shout. They've got the booth set up and they'll be doing more uh, light show and such and we'll come through and check that out and get some things on that. But a lot of great show prices here. A lot of basically you come in here and you buy it and you walk out the door with it. The power, the power bar, that's something that's been really popular right here, right there, because that has the outlets and it has um, your USB charging ports. Ah, the entourage, right there, that's something we've been talking about. A little fogger, oh, I gotta back up so I can get both cameras in there. The entourage phase, Brian Red's been talking about that. Some Cobb lights. So the big push, or the big move, is, is to these LED panels. You're going to be seeing them prominently displayed here um, and uh, at other booths. We just saw some already here. Yeah. But lots of gear lined up and ready to go. Edgar's getting the light show ready to go there. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, LED. And they've got the little curved LED pieces so you can create block lettering like this. That's really kind of a cool effect. We'll be back and get a picture of that so you can see it. Their event facade right there. Coming around, we'll continue on our way around here because we're going to get back to Global Trust and uh, check them out a little bit more. It's not quite a great if you are doing trust and you need a, a, a little shelf that can handle a lot of different things, whether you put a lighting fixture, a laptop, an iPad for access, Global Trust, and they were saying they've got a new clamp that was kind of a cool creation based on some suggestions from, I believe, DJs is what he was saying. So we'll have to come back and, and check that out. Yes, you're seeing show special pricing. This at during the DJ Expo, a couple of times a year, the manufacturers extend a special pricing to the dealers at some level, and then they can pass these savings on to you at these shows. So there's things we're seeing and experiencing here that we wouldn't experience elsewhere. Eliminator lighting is our final one. We have a better video. Yeah, last night's walk around, Albert had it all lit up and such, so we can see that one. but. Eliminator Lighting is part of the ADJ family of companies, the master family, and then there's all the different little subsidiaries. And they have really been coming on with some lighting. It's less expensive than some of the other lighting out there, but they've got they've been making some really cool fixtures, and the people have been really happy with the quality. And of course, the big wedding letters in the back there, the Mr. and Mrs. Ooh, uh, sp spooky ghost Halloween. And that mirror ball. Uh, piece has been also very popular. The Decor MBSH. What is this? I like the black truss myself. I think the if I were going to go with a big trussing like that, it would be black or the red. They do the red. Global Trust does the red at um, NAM, and I absolutely love that red look. The chrome is okay, or the aluminum color, or whatever you want to call it. But the black, I just like that black look much better. Coming around the corner, we've got the Bose, the Bose area. This is the Bose DJ truck that they're going to be uh, they're going to be up there doing their thing on. That's where Shaney will be cl climbing up in there, and she'll be doing her her show in the back of the Bose truck. I wonder if I can just give you guys a little bit of a peek up there. They're all set up, and that's where they will be broadcasting or performing from the back. I have a big old four-wheel drive pickup there. So, the Bose booth here at DJ Expo. Straight ahead is the prize where they have their ultimate DJ giveaway prizes. They're getting those set up and on display. So if you're here, and you gotta be here until the last day, then they will have a drawing and give away a lot of cool stuff. A lot of cool stuff. Again, rock and roller carts are everywhere. Everybody uses them. If you don't have a cart like that, you really need to check it out because they, they are pretty pretty impressive. Pioneer DJ is next here. Pioneer DJ has the express speakers, which they have a demo room upstairs, and we'll be able to hear them up there. They've got, of course, their turntables out here. They've got uh, controllers and all sorts of different things out here. So 
a lot of stuff out from Pioneer DJ. You can come. The cool thing about these shows is that you can come in and get your hands on things. You can come through and, and touch and feel and try it out. The, the 1000s here, that's one of the things that I want to spend a little time with. And then of course on the other side is where they're going to be selling, selling the products. And show special pricing again is pretty impressive at these uh, at these shows. You want to get yourself some, some monitors, some headphones, some controllers, whatever. This is the place to do it. So the Pioneer DJ. It's got a nice display here ready to go. Right behind that, we've got Rhode Island Novelty, which one thing about the shows, special deals, Rhode Island has a really cool special that they do here at the show also. And they are going to be here later today. The crew from Pro X is next here. They've got some cases and, and different things. And oh, they were setting up the, the facade. That'll be up and running here in a little bit. Awesome. And it, you, you see a couple of Z tables around in the room. We'll see those a little bit later. Yeah, those are Pro X Z tables. So they're getting things set up and ready to roll. Good morning. Vibo is next. Vibo is an online uh, solution for managing music for your clients. They can go and do some different things and it's all designed so it works very well with a mobile device. Vivo.io, you can check that out. We're gonna be talking more with them here as we go forward. Uh, a couple of photo booth companies that are here. Print, Print Buddy, B-U-D-I-I, -I, is here with their little... So I wonder if that's going to kill my microphones. I might have to change my microphone methodology here. And mobile apps, bbmobileapps.com. Create your own app. You guys have to check more of that out online. And then we've got a variety of different controllers and different things that they're yeah, set up here and they're gonna have. You can check one out, another, another, another. They've got a variety of them set up and ready to go here. All the way down from little ones all the way around you can check them all out there uh, let's see base boss base boss has their display here but they have a sound room upstairs and this is from my my what Dan was saying last night is it's the base boss is carrying it through incredibly well incredibly well up there so we'll have to find out more about uh, the base boss stuff upstairs just excuse me for a second I am going to clip one of the microphones from the camcorder on me, so that way I have it. So hopefully the audio won't uh, drown out as much. Uh, ADJA is uh, the American Disc Jockey Association. Drax is here and he'll be getting uh, getting folks signed up with their insurance so they can be legit businesses. Uh, ditch Games with Extreme Bingo and Trivia, different tools and things you can use for your business. Rob will be here with those. and with the cubes and the little the little packs and such they're all right there right across is odyssey odyssey cases and oh there's my favorite backpack right there in the red line series that one right there that's the one i have and i absolutely love that for my gigs right there for those of you watching they've got their facade they've got their table there Cases, of course, soft side cases, clam, clam cases, and then they have the build your own, do it yourself kit for building your own photo booth. Dave's getting the LEDs and such all turned on, so they've got a lot of solutions, a lot of different things. You can go out to OdysseyGear.com and check out a lot of their cool stuff. They're a sponsor of the Distracting News, so yay, rah rah, we love that. Love Odyssey, been using them for a lot of years. Lamoto Photo Booth is next with some of their kind of a quick little selfie booth it looks like you guys will get to see that later if you are here at the show let's see coming around here to i'm not sure which one this is i think these are the dj front board there we go dj front board is right there if you guys can see yep dj frontboard.com Getting some facade looks and such. Generally, 
this has been a really popular thing, guys. Come in here and they're like, ooh, I like that look, and off they run with it. Derby and Dance Party is next on the other side, which is a, that's something you can add to like corporate events and such and have a horse racing game, um, game in, included. Sherman Specialties, a novelty uh, company that also will have some great deals on product and such. If you want to fill, fill out your photo booth with different things for decorations and such, they are there to help you out. Okay, so we're going to come around here. Right over there is, of course, the main stage. We've got Chauvet lighting and truss, trust trussing up there. Yeah, all lighting provided by Chauvet, sound by RCF this year. So they are all up there and good to go. Now we're going to get into the In Music Companies, which uh, Guitar Center is um, sponsor, or I should say, is repping them here at the show. So we've got our den and Newmark and what have you. This is the this is the sale side where you the cash and carry, you grab it and go. The scratch, the PT01 scratch is actually something that surprising such a small little device is so popular that just to practice the scratch, so many people really who are in that type of performance, they jump all over that. This is uh, the Denon area. They've got the new SC 5000M set up. This is where where the crew is going to be performing all day, all day here at the show. So we lose we lose my microphone once we we get into a, a situation like that. So that's that's the Denon booth, and we'll be back there later today when uh, Michael is performing and such there. Promo only is next. Nick is here, and I believe Glenn is here. I haven't seen Glenn yet, but pretty excited to see Glenn. They're going to be here at the show, so yay! Uh, Techniques is not here yet. The Audio Technica with their the microphones and, and headphones, that's kind of a big thing. KRK with their monitors, a lot of those are available here at the show. Yorkville booth with the full line of Yorkville speakers at NAM, we spent a little bit of time with looking and listening to one of their 15s and I'll tell you it was an incredible sound for a 15. It was a rework of one of the speakers and as I'm just standing here I don't remember which one it was but it was really kind of cool. And a little satellite system here at the two tops and your sub. Kind of cool. Yorkville booth right there. We got Roland next. Roland where they're, oops, excuse me sir. Roland where they have the 808 set up here they've got all of them they got the two and the four and you'll take a look right there is the z table we were talking about there's a couple of them here but that's that's something that is kind of a neat table for mobile djs the z table and that's from pro x direct it's over here in a roland booth because roland has their there's the 808s uh, let's come on over here because I think they've got the smaller ones over here. All sorts of different controllers available there to play with here at the show. DAS Audio, they're getting that set up. The speaker sound systems right there. So yeah, they're going to have just a little bit of horsepower there. Just a touch bit. They will have a little bit going on for them there. Moby booth right there with their little booths. Let's see what we're coming from this angle. This is the, the Pioneer. They're getting all set up here in the Pioneer. Not Pioneer. PV. PV is getting set up here. I saw the decks there and I'm jumping to conclusions. The PV booth here at DJ Expo. And of course they've got their the uh, RBN series. I believe this was the 10 that we were going to uh, check out and look at a little bit more. I wanted to hear what that sounded like. I've not heard that one yet. And then of course they've got the PVX series of speakers. Alan from Floyd Rose is getting all set up and ready to roll. He's got his headphones out, looking ever awesome as always. So he'll be ready to roll here with some deals on his, on the headphones here from Floyd Rose. Next to Ellen is Electro Voices downstairs presence, but they are going to be upstairs with their demo room. So they just have their little their little uh, Evolve 50 on white, but you get to hear them upstairs. 
And then Photomaster, they're getting set up and such. We just talked to them at the Marquee Show. Got to chat, hello. You guys check out our Instagram, IGTV. They are on, I believe, our IGTV feed. Our walk around we did, that was pretty nice. Rain, one of the companies from In Music. Uh, they've got the, the uh, 12s and they've got the 72. All set up here. So you can see those, you can play with those. Oh, I didn't see that comment. Hang on, I'm gonna try to see if I can see that comment. Live chat. Uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. This is this is a casino hotel carpet, convention center carpet. Yeah, pretty much the same stuff. And, and uh, to a point, you, there's little things like that that made it really feel like. Uh, yeah, the 72 is back on back on the other side, Arnold. I didn't uh, I didn't show it. Um, yeah, the carpeting definitely makes you feel like you're in Vegas, and a lot of things here made this. This casino makes you feel like you are in Vegas. Over here at Chauvet, they're getting set up. Um, IDJ Now is doing the show special pricing here for Chauvet. And they've got the new, let's see, right back. Now I'll just walk over there. I'll walk over there because I've got two cameras and it's not going to give you. The two is 60. Yeah, you don't want to do that. Uh, the 260, the new Intimidator spot 260 is here and set up and ready to roll we're going to come back and look a little bit learn more about that yeah. nice yeah. they were saying they've only got a limited supply of some of their up uh, the uh, up lighting and such the freedom uh the flex they've got just a few of them here so when they're gone they are <laughs> they're, then it's i if i'm not mistaken i think there's a back order on these things uh, let's see. This is this is what I what I wanted to check out myself a little bit more. The Freedom H1, uh, the four pack of those. They've got some really good pricing going on with their Chauvet lights. So if you're in a market, this is a definite time to give them a call and say, Hey, we saw that you guys are at DJ Expo. What can you do for me? Because there is a lot of cool products here. And the guys from DJ Expo, look at look at that. Look at the focus and the intensity of these guys. They are ready to sell at the show. Right there, they are ready to do it. So give them a call if you see something from Chauvet you're interested in. IDJ now is the company that'll take care of you. Okay, so across on the other side, we've got some Alto, let's see, Alto speakers. I think they were just distributing those because we're in a Newmark area and they've got their controllers out. Yesterday, this was actually it's not a new unit, but of course the, the tri functionality actually was catching a lot of people. You can do CD, uh, thumb drive, or laptop. And of course the big flagship in the New York line, the NS73. And coming on over here. Yeah, that'll kill my mic every time. And there's the little, the little new mark scratch right there the PT01 so we'll come over here and let's see they're cleaning and such over here I think up here is where we've got the really cool stuff right there we go that way we can see it the cool kids who are standing up on the platform are going to be doing playing with the 72 and a 12 today okay so we're there we're there we're there I'm sorry I'm just spinning you guys around completely aimlessly Max Photo Booth is next. They're getting things set up and all ready to roll with their little little systems that can be snapped together or put together and off you go. Little module, that's kind of cool. Let's see, who are we looking at here? <laughs> I'm looking for anything. Oh, Rasha, Rasha, that's right, there we go. The Rasha light. That's actually a light right there, that one. I want to see what that looks like. I've seen versions of that online, the uh, Chaos. They look like a really cool light. Well, that's an interesting kind of all-in-one. I wonder if that's a, a package or if that's individual pieces that they put together. Huh, flexible. Interesting. We'll have to come back and, and see some more of this uh, with Rasha here in their booth. So next we've got the phase booth here that has, well we won't see one yet, 
But basically what it is, is this, this little device right here, they're doing kind of a world tour to show it, and yet they don't have them available yet because they're, they're so new. But it's just that little device, and it sits there, and it wirelessly connects and talks, and, and you don't need to have a needle. It'll get your, it'll transfer your scratch movements to your device and such and control it and, and be able to do everything without a needle on the record, which is kind of cool. Especially those times where you might have you know, a needle, if you could, it's gonna cause wear, moving parts, the phase will eliminate that. And they were saying it's really, really good. So I'm kind of excited to check that out. Uh, we're over here with the mix, mix wear booth where they've got the cases, they've got, got their, their sound and such, the phonic there. They've got the mix art, mixers. They get, uh, they've got a, let's see, the magma case is over here. Got to do this somewhat in order. Deck savers, do they have a deck saver? Deck savers are kind of a, you can see the shiny, they're a plastic cover um, that, that allows you to, hey, that's not annoying at all. I'm gonna see if I can bring this mic up. So the, they allow, allow a person to be able to protect their gear from dust and spills and such, say if I, at the, I have one in my office, on my, in my studio, I throw that over top of the mixer, the controller, so that way it stays nice and clean. Continuing on down, of course you got the, the Rasha booth there. We've got Atlanta Photo Booth next, Steve, Steve Lynch out of Atlanta, they are here and they've got their, their thing, so they are all set up. I think Teresa just uh, stepped out, she was just here. But they've got their full line. Oh, there's the rover. Hey, we get to see it. The rover is a remote control. You can see the remote control right there. This is actually one that, that I have, and we've been using it in the office. But I have a son who is, like Steve Lynch, likes to create and do things. And he's working on it to make it so it's a follow me. So I think he and Steve are going to be getting together because it will be something that will drive up to people, sense where people are, and then stop and basically you know, beg for a picture. Kind of like your puppy does when you have when you have a sandwich. So they're going to work on that. FBT is on the other side with their array, a couple of array systems there. The Speckle cables is next. We've got um, their wiring. Uh, Brian Red talks a lot about the Speckle as one of the premium speaker cables that he has used. Ape Labs, which has a couple of different lights, we're going to take a look at here. They've got, of course, some IP rated lights, and then they have lights that are just a little bit bigger than the cup that's in that gentleman's hand. And we'll get to see those. Um, let's see. Oh, I can give you. I can actually show you the sketch of it. If you haven't seen them, they're again like about the size of a can of soda. But they have got a couple of different lights here at the show. Less expensive for uplighting, and they uh, they do a really nice job. They were using those at the Marquee Show, and it was pretty cool. Smacked Shop are here with some of their swag and right there. The guys are getting set up. Uh, here's that DJ booth we were talking about from Georgia Expo. It's a, a nice little pipe and drape system. Quick and easy and it all breaks down into one bag for easy transport. And then of course you can have your DJ table behind it. It is about, oh I'd say about three foot tall give or take on that but it's just kind of helps clean up that look and would have some flexibility and such obviously they have the front that's printed in this case but you can have curtains and it could be longer shorter whatever you need GE has good stuff what good who, GE I'm not enough oh, oh yeah Georgia Expo okay well, I bet sorry uh, events C CRM it's early in the day and I'm, you know, I'm kind of forgetful and old, that's what happens. I've been CRM and they, all, they are here. And then Smartphone Trivia, if you are here from speedquizinusa.com, they are going to be doing their thing here at the show. I'm going to turn this around and this is going to be kind of clumsy and it's probably not going to fit on the video properly, but hey, I'm going to give it a try. Um, that is the exhibit hall here at DJ Expo. I've um, had some people asking, it's like, it looks a little bit smaller than in the past. It's different in, in some ways. There's a few people who have been here before that aren't here this year. There's that, I mean, it's just the reality of the situation. But we've got a, light, a nice, diverse crew here to give you time to play and look at some neat things. And then, of course, we have demo rooms upstairs. So we've got uh, Pioneer has a demo room showing the speakers and controllers up there also. 
Electra Voice is upstairs with um, their demo room. That's where uh, the Tuesday night with Ben Stowe, we actually shot that and talked about some things. Uh, I'm gonna just do this because I need to hold it up by the. So we've got, um, and then Avante Audio's up there. We didn't get a, anything, didn't see anything from them down, okay, down there. And then we have um, Bass Boss and RCF. So RCF's up there showing off their different uh, Evox systems and so, what have you. Uh, Avante, I'm hoping that they have their new array system up there so we can check that out. Uh, Electro Voice says theirs, RCF has got that, you'll be able to actually touch and feel some of the stuff in all of those demo rooms if you're here. So anyway, that's pretty much it from DJ Expo 2018, the exhibit hall, walk around, ADJ, we were over there, that was in, in the early part of it. If you're watching us online, we're way back there, yes, there's no seating this year. Uh, just event game booth. The uh, that, that that event game um, that horse that horse game, yeah. There's no lounge here. There's no anything. It's basically you get out and you got to walk walk down the the aisle there a little bit. Um, I'm gonna shut the the camcorder off and. Uh